This is just a short little video here. Um, I don't know how many of you out there have heard of David Flynn. Uh, God rest his soul, I think he passed away the 22nd of last year in January. But he's quite brilliant. He has a lot of knowledge and he can open a lot of doors of your thought. I like him quite well. I've never Unfortunately, I've never really mentioned him in any stuff I've talked about. You've heard me mention Tom Horn, Steve Quayle, you know, people, other people like that, but I forgot and left David out. But, uh, if you haven't ever watched any of his stuff, he has done some excellent research. Um, he helped to put a lot of the pieces of the puzzle in their place where they belong. And I believe he's helped uh, help us along the road of figuring some stuff out. So actually, I just wanted to show uh, this man here's site is where this video came from. You can either go to the site or click a link. But I'm going to put uh, well, I'll put two or three of his videos up, and then his website and stuff. And you all can take it from there. But he surely is interesting. He points out a lot of facts and a lot of anomalies that maybe a lot of people overlook. Or didn't realize. Or maybe they needed some kind of little more proof uh, to believe. So I'll get this up here in just a bit. And, uh... We'll be watching that uh, fireball stuff over in Russia. And I believe I did read it in certain areas, maybe not the U.S., but I believe they did say it, it could be possible that you may be able to view 2012 DA-14 with a, you know, a telescope and some binoculars. Um, it's going to be going quite fast. And it may not be that bright. So we'll see. God bless you all. Speak with you soon.